Well, walking up the hill, seen a spike. I got him. About a 60 yard shot broadside, piled him up. He's down in there. Can't see him from here, but he's down. Glad I showed up late today. <laughs> this whole daylight savings time thing kind of threw me off. So, yeah. Showed up an hour late and killed a buck. So, well, let's go get our hands on him. It's funny, you see the road hunter behind me? <laughs> you miss out. You got to get out and get after it. Let's go get him. Well, been out here looking for like 15 minutes. He's right there. Let's see what we're working with. We got some bone there. We got some bone there. You know, I told myself I wouldn't take a spike the first weekend, but I just couldn't. Couldn't take the chance to eat a tag, so he will taste very, very good. And we will enjoy him very much. Alright guys, so again, I didn't get it on film. This guy jumped out at about 60 yards and he is going the other direction. There was a guy down the road just road hunting, so it just like I had to quick draw him, and it worked perfect. He, uh, yeah, he met, went maybe five feet and was completely done. Took me a lot longer for the uh, recovery effort than it did to actually hunt him. About 200 yards from my truck, pretty much. Just started hunting. Just wanted to tell the story. I uh, kind of forgot that it was daylight savings time and what that actually meant. <laughs> meant that it was going to be getting daylight an hour sooner so it didn't compute to me that instead of waking up at 4.05 in the morning I needed to wake up at 3.05 to get to where I normally am at daylight and do what I usually do so it was an hour late I pulled in it was already shooting light uh, the gate was loaded just down the road from me, like it always is, typically on the last day of deer season. But I took my other route that I take where I kind of start hunting immediately. And sure enough, the first corner I came on, a uh, little spiker buck right there. I have a pretty good policy that I try to stick to, that I don't kill spikes until the end. And I made it to the very last day. There's still extended buck. But I actually like to save extended buff for taking new people out to hunting, you know, because I like introducing people to hunting. And, uh, yeah, so now I will get to do that. We'll get this guy all processed and taken care of down the hill, the vigorous drag to my truck. I'll always be a meat hunter. Uh, was just about to run out of burger. So, I, I'm stoked. I'm stoked. So we'll get this guy all bucked up and down the hill and out the road. See ya.